today I'm going to show you how to get the golden eye look. I'm Emily Loftus of Loftus Says, and this is Sarah Odie. We've already primed her face. We have bronzer right around the helmet area. Eyebrows are filled in. We're going to go back to my physician's formula that I just love, and we're just going to bring it in on her eyelid. I'm using the physician's formula right now as an eyeshadow, but I use this for everything. I use it for contour, I use it for cheekbones, for highlight, I use it across the chest, but today I'm going to use it for eyeshadow. Next is Milani Gold Eyeshadow, because I like to use numerous colors. Once again, we're just gonna dab, dab, dab it on. So for a subtle look, we would just do this. Keep it underneath the eyebrow bone, always. But since nothing I do is subtle, we are going to wet this to make it more intense. So just grab water, dip your brush in. This is still the same product, we just wet it to make it more intense. And this will actually really seal it into the eye. Anytime you wet an eyeshadow, it will not move all night. You can dance, you can go out, you can cry. <laughs> it's not going to move. And see the difference of intensity? Here's a tip. I never like to do eyeshadow with brushes. I like to just tap, 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 and you tap it in to place. That's how you can really control the eyeshadow and what you're doing. And I'm gonna go ahead and drag it along. Because it's gold, we don't have to be so perfect like we were with blue or green or any other bright colors. Drag the same color underneath. And we're doing all this before eyeliner. For the golden eye look, I like to use a brown eyeliner. Definitely not black, it is, it's too sharp, it's too intense. So I go for a, a chubby pencil. This is from Buxom and we're going to just bring it in, drag it on. It does not have to be exact because it's gonna kind of blend in with the eyeshadow. This look is so hot in Hollywood. Beyonce loves to do this look. It makes her skin look just radiant. I've seen this on Charlotte Johansson. Carrie Underwood's a big fan. It looks really beautiful on the red carpet, everyday life print, editorial. You just can't go wrong with this look. I'm not even gonna blend in the eyeliner. I'm not even worried about it. We're gonna throw on some black mascara. This is CoverGirl Lash Blast. I actually don't wanna use fake eyelashes on this. I think it pulls away from the overall look. You want everyone to look at your entire eye, not just the top part of your eye. So forget the lashes on this look. I'm actually gonna bring it in underneath. I don't usually always do this, but. To really intensify this look, I'm gonna use pigment. You can get this at any drugstore at MAC. The key to this is to once again, wet it to make sure you can manipulate where you're going. So we're gonna do a tap, tap, tap. This will literally make you look like a goddess. It looks just like gold flakes. The light reflects so beautifully off of this. You really can't feel like a glamour girl without this. <laughs> you have to throw in the glitter. I'm just gonna bring it very lightly underneath. Just tap, tap, tap underneath the lash line. I definitely suggest not putting on your outfit till afterwards to make sure you get all the glitter off. To top off this look, this is a limited edition from Chanel. It's called Ore, and it's a gold liner. So you can get gold eyeliner anywhere, but I feel like this one's just exceptional. So I'm gonna close your eyes. We're just gonna bring it in just at the beginning of her eye, right in the crevice, on top of her brown eye liner.
just a little bit. It's just gonna draw your eye to the center right here. So we're just gonna make a V, basically. You can put it everywhere, I just think it looks too crazy. This is perfect for daytime, nighttime, red carpet events, everything. So this is it, this is how to do the golden eye look. Let me recap for you. Her face was already done with primer and bronzer. We throw gold in, we wet it to make it really seal. Put a brown liner, black mascara, and gold liner right on the inside. And now to finish it off, just do a very pale pink lipstick. Once again, we're just gonna dab, dab, dab. We want all of the attention on her beautiful eyes. Not her lips, not her cheeks, not her forehead, not anything else, just the eyes. And that's how to get the golden eye look. Thanks so much to Sarah Odie. I'm Emily Loftus of Loftus Says.